Hey girls, I'm back with another um, haul. Uh, not really a review because I have not yet used any products from this company. But first and foremost, I want to say that I heard about this company from my dear friend Wendy Bentley, Bentley Blonde. Uh, many of you, many of you subscribers have her as uh, one of your subscriptions, and she's really sweet and she's amazing, and I love you, Wendy. Um, she gave such an amazing review about this company that I had to see what was up. So, the name of the company is Ghost Milk Stuff, and this is the cute packaging it comes in. You can't see an address, so cute packaging. And then the soaps come, well, the little note comes inside. And let me show you the note, which is so touching. So they have your invoice and things like that. And then the kids write, like, thanks. Well, I don't want to show too much. But they write thanks. And they then the kids write the samples. And you can tell, let's see if I can get this. You can tell it's their handwriting. So super cute. Fiji Island, Los Valentines, whatever. So really cute, and then they give you little um little notes about their soaps and which ones that I have bought and everything like that. So I got the citrus set, and honestly, I was not impressed with it. Maybe I should have got something that Wendy has reviewed, but. I was in a, um, I've been in a citrus mood, so the scents I got is lemon, lime, and love spell. So, um, love spell smells exactly like love spell from Victoria's Secret. I love it. Mmm, smells really delicious. And it's a nice size bar. And this is a little baggie it came in. Really cute. And you can tell that it's homey and the kids did it and it's really nice. Then this is lemon. Now, it doesn't smell like lemon to me. I mean, it's just too potent for my, my nose buds. It smells like ivory soap, the lemon and the lime. Now, this is a lime. It smells like, it just smells like soap, like ivory soap. That's just soap that it reminds me of, which I don't like ivory soap, so not too happy about this. Maybe I could find someone that will put this to use, but um, I'm sure there's so many other uh, smells that I will love, but love smell is amazing. I love it. Then, I'm glad I got this in the big bar, um, the handmade gold smoke soap in black raspberry. And so it comes in this cute little package. Really adorable. I love this little bag. It's so cute. And then, black raspberry. So nice. And it smells oh, amazing. This is by far my favorite scent. It is so amazing. I. I adore it. So far, this is my favorite scent from Goat Smell Stuff. So, I love it. It smells so good, I don't even want to use it. That's how good it smells. Like, I just want the aroma. Like, just always pick it up and smell it. Um, and then the samples that they gave me was, is Fiji Island, which is this yellow green one. And I like Fiji Island. I definitely have to get this next time. I love it. it. Smells really nice, very summery and fruity and really good. This should have been in the citrus set. Then they gave me another love spell, which I don't know why it became in the, the setting of the citrus uh, package, but that's okay. More love spell, the more better. And of course, it smells exactly like love spell. And then they gave me sandalwood. And ugh. I don't like this smell. <laughs> not my. It's not a part of my scent. Uh, my my nose buds can't handle this. But it's 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 all right if you like this. But um, I'm really impressed with the company because everything is so homey and I love how the kids are involved and it's really cute and I'm glad that my dear friend Wendy mentioned this. I love to support small family companies and 
trying things from different companies, especially when it comes to goat's milk salt, because I'm very open-minded. And amazingly, each and every company I love something different from. So, you know, I you should see my section of soap. I have such a huge section of goat's milk soap right now. So, I am obsessed. I love it. Anyway, I hope you like this review. And if any of you have tried any of these products, please write below um, what, what is your favorite scents from Goat Smoke Stuff. And if any of you ever tried Lemon and Lime and you like it, please let me know below. Maybe I can send it to you through the mail. But you have to be 18 or older. Um, and these are the, the scents. Um, I might as well give it to someone that will put it to use. Cause it's not fair to have something and I'm never going to use it. Anyway, I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Um, before I go, I just want to show you my outfit of the day. Because I've been making too many videos today. So first of all, I have my eye makeup from the palette that I showed you in the past video from my friend g Renee. I have my Maybelline 24 Hour Foundation and my uh, NYX Blushable Stick with uh, my MAC dark to light uh, blush and then I have my my uh, benefit um, hula bronzer on my cheeks and my lips from the lip products that I showed you earlier they're new to me so I can't remember them this is from Victoria's Secret I had it in the past video I'm loving it right now so I've been wearing it a lot I got this beautiful necklace from Avon and I got this gorgeous outfit from this place called Lolita and it's just really cute you can wear um, well it's kind of short because I'm sitting down you pull it out and it's very cute and I love the design the designs are very it's very cute it's chic it's sexy then I have these gorgeous heels that I bought from, I don't know if you can see it, from Avon, and I love them. They're comfortable, and they're really cute, they're beige, I love the detailing on it, this is so cute, it's really pretty, it's chic, it's simple, it's not too out there like, hey, look at me, so I'm really loving my outfit, and Overall, it's comfortable, and I love that. Comfort is a virtue. Okay, all. I love you. I'll see you soon with more videos. Bye-bye now.